Hey guys, Enla TV here, and since the last time we played OK Quinn, <laughs> there have been some major, and when I say major, I mean some major game changing updates. For example, this little plum bob has changed over Jesse's head. It is no longer the normal Sims plum bob, it is a plum bob simplifying that she is an alien. Not to mention, guess what age division has been added to the game? after years of people complaining that's right toddlers i'm not kidding if you do not play the sims toddlers are in the damn game i am so happy you have no idea and it's also our little man our little pride and joy's birthday today and we are going to be celebrating that because he's begun going to become a what what words did i just say he is going to be becoming a teenager he is nauseous right now why uh, from eating spoiled food. Okay, well, that's not a great way to start off your birthday. So we're gonna have a birthday party for him and everything, and then we can start working on a whole new storyline for season two, guys. And I'm gonna be popping in a little bit with him as 18, but because uh, I'll be able to come up with the storyline, I do want you guys to see the storyline as it's progressing and I never turned my phone off and you guys just heard snapchat <laughs> um, what was I talking about um, landscape project oh just go back to nursery okay uh, I forgot Nova had, Nova had a job but I do want you guys to be involved in the whole new plot line that will be involved with season two what the flea market is in town. Okay, I've never heard that music in my life and that frightened me. I'm not gonna lie, I did not really play much with city living, even though I was really hyped with it. But anyways, speaking of content, guess what they announced, guys? If you follow me on Twitter, I was flipping my damn lid, okay? I was like going crazy. They announced that Vampires are going to be added and they also announced pets and it's giving me the Sims 3 feels and I'm so happy because we got toddlers now and ah! So season 2 is going to be amazing because we have toddlers and then by the time season 2 starts we will have vampires and I still need a few game packs so I'm gonna pick and choose which ones I want and I'm definitely going to be choosing Sims 4 vampires first so <laughs> oh uh also a little update i redecorated the boys rooms completely 100 percent let's just go into free camera mode uh this side is alfred's side i believe and then this side is 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 oh my god where am i this side is nova's side so Uh, sadly guys, we cannot give Alfred a very good trait today because he is our next founder. So what does that mean? He- oh, that's lovely, Alfred, thank you. He is going to be given the trait of hating children. Because I was explaining to someone the other day, I think this was yesterday. I keep going into the mic and I'm sorry. I- I did it again. I was explaining to someone what the Sims 4 Perfect Genetics Challenge exactly is. And I went back and I rewatched my first video from the series, which was Pick Your Founder. And in that video, oh, it's not responding. <laughs> and in that video, I stated that part of the rules are each founder has to hate children. Why that's a part of the rules, I honest to God do not know. Um, so, and there's one part of the rules that I am not following. This is, like, from The Sims 3 rules. I don't really know what The Sims 4 rules are. I'm playing off The Sims 3 rules that I found. Uh, part of the rules were to... Another message. <laughs> part of the rules were to complete your, uh, aspiration. And I really don't want to do that, so, because that's, that's a lot of... That's a lot of work. I don't think- I think I've only completed one aspiration out of any sim that I've ever- 
played with. <laughs> I can just use aspirations as like a way to drive character development. Well, anyways, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get mommy over here to throw her son the best birthday party ever a social event. Can you stop talking to your daughter for one second, please? Come on, Star. Any day now, Star. Come on. It shouldn't take this long. Who are you on the phone with? There we go. My god. Alright. Birthday party. There it is. You know the residence. Hey, I would like to come over and hang. Is that okay? He knew that we were having a party. Fine, Jay. You can come over. If you do not remember, Jay was from the first... The first, uh... first couple episodes we thought that we were gonna hook up with Jay. Quinn is a bit occupied right now so he still go to work. Take a PTO. It's your son. It is your lineage's birthday. Your pride and joy. The next person to go on the Prince of Six on. Cause you know technically technically is Stardust even a queen because she was never coronated. So is she still a princess even though she's married? I don't know how that works. All right, mother, mummy, 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 mummy. Come here, stop with the fast forward stuff. All right, so come here. We are going to have you make a special recipe. What? Oh, cause she's all energized, that's why. More choices, no, that's, okay. I should probably clean out the spoiled food, but we haven't made, so. Uh, cook. I don't understand why making cakes is not underbake, but uh, the world may never know. Um, I think I mentioned that every single time I see that. So what would our, our lovely, lovely little boy love? Um, a zombie cake, perhaps? A uh, blue cake? Let's, uh, let's go with a blue confetti cake. Why the hell not? Oh, that was cute! Wait, I wanted to get a picture of that! <laughs> no! That was so cute! We're gonna have to update this thumbnail because if he is aging up, he's a kid in the thumbnail. So we're gonna have a new thumbnail, possibly. Possibly. Unless I should just wait until the second season to change the thumbnail. Alright, so there's Bella. We're gonna have Sunny invite over her new boo. Her new boo! Speaking of Boo, where are you, Boo? Uh, Deontay. Let's invite to hang out at current lot. Who else could we invite? Over... No one, really. Uh, you're a teen. We can invite you over. Invite to... Invite to hang out in current lot. Um, but da, 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 who else do you know? Okay, because you know I gotta I gotta get these girls hooked up, man. Be right over. Oh, girl, your outfit is cute AF. Why do I not remember putting that on you? Okay. Alfred, where are you? Uh, we're gonna need to come up with a plan for Alfred. Like, who is he? What kind of person is he? I feel like he's gonna be a very sweet person. I don't see him being evil. Not in any sense of the word. Add birthday candles. This is a pretty lame birthday compared to like what Jesse had with like the bubble blowers and stuff. But I just want to get his birthday out the way. So you're gonna come blow your candles, boy. We are almost two years into this freaking thing and we are not even on generation dose yet. Okay, so where are you going? 
Go blow out your candles, boy. You're not gonna come sit? Okay, you're just stand there. No! Okay, I got that pause right away. That is perfect. I absolutely love that. I am so taking screenshots right now. I love this. <laughs> oh god, I love pausing the sims at the right time. <laughs> oh god. Alright, we're gonna hit play again. <laughs> Wait, did I not take screenshots? No! Why is my C button not working? Okay, well... Teenage um, romantic tri- tri-, tri <laughs> Sweaty gym shorts, her mortal people away. <laughs> Those are new? Okay. Um. Huh. Let's see. I think he should have the love trait because his mother wants to find her soulmate. And her reasoning for that, because if you remember my machinima, haha, <laughs> I will go over that in season two premiere. But um, if you do not remember, she was escaping Sixon from being in a relationship she did not want to be in. Um, let's see. What could we give you? I don't think you're creative. You're not deviant. Maybe he wants to do what his mother told him, and that's fulfill the lineage. He's definitely not on flirty, because that would just ruin everything. Hates children. That's what we have to give you. So you're going to hate kids. <laughs> Oh, dear lord, his voice. Did any of you hear that? Esta no me gusta. <laughs> okay. Um, well. Let, let's hope we can make him look cute, because right now we're not, we're not doing so good. <laughs> let's, uh, let's go ahead and plan outfits. I will, uh, see you guys in cast, so I will be... Yeah right back okay so for a second i was gonna say what is this and then i remembered with the update we no longer have to worry about switching between stuff so we can literally switch from what he looks like here to what he looks like here which by the way i don't know what jesse looks like in her <laughs> human disguise okay she looks interesting what does star look like i don't remember uh, right. Forgot about that. Hmm. Maybe we'll change that. Probably not. <laughs> Alright, so to you, mister. Let's... The rules are we change your hair and stuff with you guys. And, yeah. So, I don't know what I want to go for here. He has to have black hair, so... I've never used these before, apparently. Oh, no. Fun fact, I absolutely hate man buns in real life. In The Sims, maybe they can work. No, that... No. No. Uh, you look like Prince Eric right now. I kind of want something that shows your ears, because you're... That makes you look like Spock. I don't know. Maybe that could work. I don't know. I feel like it doesn't fit his personality. Um, that's sort of cute. Guy hairlines are so weird in this game. Um, I can give you this hair. No, what is with your nose? It's so pointy. I don't like it. It's too pointy. Oh, I forgot we made Quentin look that creepy. Look how creepy he looks, man. That's where you got your pointy nose from. Ah, that's why. Okay. Well, we're gonna go back now. Um, no hair. 
Thank you. What is all this stuff? New stuff and face? Um... I don't know what we can put on you. Oh, that's cute! I like that. This is base game here. Uh, that's... no. What is this one? I've never seen this one. Unless I have it, I just don't remember. That makes you look older than what you are. No. No, no, no. <laughs> we can always put this on you. I mean... <laughs> um... <laughs> Alright, now I'm just goofing around. Okay, um, I mean, this one's not bad. I do like it. What about facial hair? Should we give him facial hair? No. No. Okay. No facial hair as of right now. <laughs> right now, facial hair does not float my boat. Alright, so I will cut back once we finish him. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, so I am out of create a sim. <laughs> it only took for freaking ever. Uh, I could not figure out what I wanted to get him in, and I realized I forgot to show you guys his outfit in Cass. But, uh, this is his party wear. So let me quickly, uh, outfits, change outfit. You can see it in this little menu here, hopefully if it loads. That's everyday one, that's everyday two, formal, uh, athletic, and sleep, and party, and then his swimwear is swimmer. Okay, so. I am going to end it here. I know this episode's really short compared to a lot of my other episodes. If I feel like it needs to be changed, what's wrong with him? Uh, feeling angry of an unpleasant conversation. Who are you conversing with? Anyways, so I am going to start working on new plot and everything for season two. And I hope you guys are excited for season two, even though he's only a teen. We will be- I will be working hard on it, not we. Uh, I will pop in every now and again with updates from him. It's not going to be like what it's been in the past, where I want to make sure I got everyone's birthdays in, and this and that. We are going- I'm going to be working on relationships, I'm going to be working on plot and whatever, because I like plot-driven stuff. So, anyways guys, I will see you all later. Leave suggestions down in the comments below. And I will see you all later. Remember, this is not just my channel. This is your channel, too. Bye!